Hello, everybody. Welcome to today's episode of Astronauts, where we're playing as... Scream! <laughs> How Weasel ends up doing that voice on a regular basis, I will never know. But we're playing a Scree today, and I'm... I mean, I'm not much of a Scree player. Honestly, I don't play a good chunk of the cast. If you had to force me to pick, like, my top, I don't know, five knots, there'd be Voltar, there'd be Max. I think... No, Max would be at the top, then Voltar, then... No. Max, then Dizzy, then Voltar... There we go, that works. But then after that, it gets a little bit hazy. Ix at one point Raylan lately, just because of the sheer number of times that the random button gives me uh, you know, Raylan to play. Swiggins I've been enjoying a lot lately as well. It's it's weird to it's a weird call, but Max is definitely my top. Dizzy's probably my second. Voltard, probably my third. Scree? Nowhere near there. I've always been bad with this character. I don't know how, but just apparently he's easy for some people. I have not understood how. It's just one of those things where my mind hasn't quite clicked with how to play him, but you know what? Maybe this time. Maybe this time I'll be able to... No, no, it's not happening. <laughs> so Blinghound plays Raylan pretty much exclusively. I mean, Blinghound does also play Lone Star, but uh, lots of experience with Raylan. Very, you know, confident player on that front. I'm not... Uh, not like They're not going to be worried. Scary Leon... And then Haku has no badges, leads me to believe it's gonna have to be scary. So what do I want to do, you know, to be able to deal with these guys? Well, we're gonna want to make sure that we're doing as much damage as possible. Uh, how do we do that? I'm thinking that we go like this. Thank you very much, and I'll just say thank you very much. Good luck, have fun. All right, so we're gonna go for as much damage as possible. We're up against the team that largely doesn't really care about being slowed initially, but we are probably gonna go for it just because. Hey, did you guys see Leon? Did you? Because we're going we're gonna to be able to zap him and then see him for, for reasons. Also, I just noticed there's hearts everywhere. Because, you know. Okay. That was a good teleport. I'm not going to lie. I kind of mistimed that pretty badly. Blinghound gets zapped. Not going to happen. Okay, that's fine. I think I got a good zap on. I'm not sure anymore. I was trying to pull the saw blade back to... Ooh, Hello. Oh, Jesus. You know what? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm totally okay. Don't even worry about it. Um, I was just going to say, I was trying to pull the saw blade back up to be able to get a kill. Hardy Cell gets the kill onto Blinghound. We got a double kill. Oh, Jesus. Pull back! Holy shit. Was that the world's best totem? <laughs> oh, wow. What? I mean, I'll take it. That's fine, but... Uh, now it's time, a good time to run. Uh, if sn if a uh, sniper or nibs comes in, I'm totally toast. So I'm gonna back off quickly. Um, that was hilarious. I don't think I've ever had that level of luck before in my life. Do I want to go all the way back, or do I want to? Oh, sorry, friend. Go home. It's okay. I'll hold down the fort. I promise to use my HP wisely. That's right. No jumping. If I hang out here, I am unsnipable. Okay, put out a little bit of damage. Gonna go ahead, zap these, get some H pizzles. Okay, I hit nothing at all. Not not a good thing. Not a good thing. I'm honestly mind flooded, and that's okay. Like this is just one of those characters that for me is a mind flooding character. That's all that this character wants to do. Is all this character can do to me. Can't make me do anything I don't want to do. <laughs> it can make me do a lot of things I don't want to do. But as it, as it stands right now. I have a hard time being able to focus on everything that I need to be doing with this character. I don't have any of the muscle memory at all. And there is, like, muscle memory involved, for sure. You're probably, you're not toasted. At what point did you not get toasted? I'm a little mad. Alright, so Raylan's still, a, like, Raylan ended up dying. That's a shame. Not an impossible thing to deal with, but a, a shame regardless. We're gonna bounce away, uh, and I'm thinking to myself, what if we... Just, uh, A, first up. Picked up both of those. Got six solar for it. Sweet. Second. Almost. Almost. Uh, how about we go ahead and stick around for, like, a little bit longer? But we're gonna need to head home and spend money soon, is my main deal. We are very rich, compared to where we should be. Shoink. Uh, excuse me. I was supposed to pull back, like, a million years ago. I'm a little mad at that taking for as long as it did. Uh, I am safe from snipes here, so I will just continue to blast... We are using Totem very, very defensively, and I think that's okay, if I'm being honest with you. 
Okay, so we didn't get anybody there. Do we have a pullback target? We do not. That's okay. Okay, I got sniped. That's fair. That's fine. I don't mind. See if I give a shit. Okay, we're gonna toss that out. Oh, God! Actually, you know what? We're gonna stick around a little longer. Pull this back. Maybe get an extra... Ooh, we got some extra solar. Um... Hold on. Okay, I'm a little worried about my uh, HP situation here. In terms of, like, how quickly it seems to be going down. Oh! Oh, my lord. We almost got that. We almost got that. I was actually very close. I am very surprised by the fact that we keep getting close. That one kill that we did end up getting randomly was very, very cool. We have been doing okay. I'm just... I'm still very much confused as to how I'm managing to do anything. Uh, let's go ahead and pick up Steel Drum. We are going to go ahead and pick up Pills for the Mine so that way we can see uh, the enemy Leon whenever we slap him with a lightning, you know, with the chain lightning. The slow actually also helps in a lot of other different ways as well. So I'm going to go ahead and just be happy that, that we have it. Oh, we're going to bounce through here. Pull back the saw. Does nothing. That's fine. Continue to zap these things. It's not going to do too much, but it will get us a little extra solar there as a result of everything. Oh. Okay, we got a kill instead. That's fine. We managed to get a slow off on the Leon. The Leon might die. Not happening anytime soon, it seems. I will get the kill there. Okay, that's fine. We got a triple kill. I'm okay with this. Let's go. And by a triple kill, I mean we got two kills. So you know, don't even worry about it. It's okay. We're actually managing to play well as Scree, sort of. Keep zapping. Raylan's back by now, which is obviously a problem, but one that we can deal with. Back off now. Uh, we don't have enough HP to survive a snipe, so I will go home immediately. What do we need next? Lifesteal on Saw would be a great way to stay alive, so we are going to pick that up. But now I think we need to start thinking very carefully about our left-click upgrades. We have slow, right? That's great. That's important. But I also want to make sure that the slow reapplies a lot, and fairly often, honestly. Ooh, nice. Ow. Bad. That's very bad. Lots of lots of lots of damage. I should not have taken half that damage, but that's okay. Okay, stay away from the from the fire and the flames, thank you. Got a little bit of extra lifesteal off of that, which is fine, but Honestly, I'm just trying to make sure that my brain stays alive. I <laughs> I am so confused. I, I think we're doing okay. I think we're picking up the right upgrades. Like, damage, 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 more damage is never usually a bad plan. But uh, it can be a bad plan if it's used impro if it's uh, bought improperly. Okay, whoa. Well, I'm dead. Uh, and Scree as a whole is incredibly squishy, so if we get in the wrong spot, we will die. We got in the wrong spot there, so we died. That's only fair. That's expected, honestly, at that point. Let's talk about how this character is supposed to work. So, Scree is terrifying. I still think he's one of the best characters in the game. Why is he terrifying? The reason why I find him terrifying is because he's an incredibly good harasser. He's able to poke a lot harder than most other knots, and super safely too. Like, I toss out a saw blade, and then what? Like, we're... Anybody who's coming too close to that droid wave is gonna take the damage. We can pull it back to deal extra damage. We can send out the saw blade to deal damage. Like, there's just... This is just, it, it's so easy. It's so safe. We will easily control the middle if we just toss out a saw blade once in a while. That works. Whoop, like that one. Like, they can't use this bounce pad without potentially getting hurt. And we did manage to get that pull on that, so that's nice. We're going to hide here, but, oh, hold on. I thought I saw a thing. Oh, God. Toss the, 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 the totem. Scary. Despite being a good, like a great harasser, even, uh, it does come with its caveats. We are incredibly squishy. So if you know how to move with Scree, you tend to be fine. It's kind of like Voltar in that sense, where Voltar is very much a mobility-centric character. If you can get the mobility to work, then you're like good to go, really. Um, I don't think we're going to land this kill anytime soon, unfortunately. Okay, we're not going to land anything. That's very disappointing that that saw blade got teleported out of. Like, that... That Nibs knows exactly what Nibs is doing. I'm a little mad about it. Okay, got one. Gonna continue to go for more, maybe. Nope, not a place I want to be anymore. We're alive. What a time. 
Haku died instead. I'm fine with this. Come downstairs. Pull it back in. Maybe get the... Nope, no lifesteal. That's fine. Uh, I want to kind of leave that for Swiggins, because Swiggins could use the HP more than I can, potentially. If he, if he sees it. If he doesn't see it, then, you know, no, obviously, but... Poink. I'll just go ahead and lifesteal that and steal the creep while I'm at it. Oh, speaking of stealing creeps, thank you. Uh, team is not on the left side of the map, so make sure you stay to the right. You don't want to be in front, is the main thing. Like, you want to be aggressive with Scree, I think, but you don't want to be in front. Like, it's just, it's too risky to be in front. He takes so much damage so fast, it's actually incredible. Oh, if there was an anchor grapple in there too, I would have been thrilled, but... Okay, got a little bit of life steal, a little bit of saw blade harassment in there. Nope, not quite landing those left clicks, but that's okay. We will be able to a little bit there. Perfect. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to end up going for a number of bounces and then... Wait, no. Don't be silly. Why would you go for number of bounces when you could go for zapping everything in an area around you? That's so much better. Like with slows that apply multiple times, that is incredible. Why wouldn't I do that instead? Okay, we're managing to do a little bit of damage. We are harassing. The nibs is toast. Okay, get zapping then. Okay, we need to play it a little safe here because if I get tongued out or something, it's going to be a very bad day for everybody involved. Perfect. Keep zapping. We do not have a totem for another three seconds. We can still see you. You're dead. Okay, good stuff. We got another turret. That was easy. Leave it to Swiggins there. Swiggins needs it more than I do by a long shot. And uh, it's 10 minutes in, and we're commanding this game from start to finish. I'm going to go ahead and blame this on the, you know, Raylan and the Swiggins going, like, 7 and 3 on the Raylan. And then, like, Swiggins has not died. He's gone 2-0 oh, and, like, 7. That's that's incredibly good. That's exactly what he should be doing. Okay, get that pullback. Nice damage on all the creeps. Back off. Now, it's worth mentioning at this point that it would maybe be a good move to... And I do mean this, like, only as a maybe. Oh, hold on. Uh, 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 protect our Ray Ray. Protect my Ray Bay. Get out of here. That's right. You screw right off. It's going to be worth it for us to, like, go back home and, like, spend is what I was trying to say that entire time. But <laughs> uh, we're going to go for Ceremonial Mask and then a rank in damage and then a rank in pills because we need the HP. Okay, fantastic. We seem to be doing totally fine. We are not playing a build that I think is correct. I, it's worth mentioning that anytime I'm not playing a character I know very well anyway you your your feedback is probably more useful than you think it is like if the vast majority of the time your feedback's probably a lot more helpful than you think it is nope not gonna happen unfortunate i got completely caught out the swiggins might be able to get a kill if he can uh if he can find it but ooh, no dice no dice the anchor is not gonna land and that Raylan is running is she gonna live uh, I'm not sure. Leon's coming down. Now it's a 3v2 up there. And suddenly it's a 3v1. And I don't think that Raylan's getting out of that one alive, if I'm being completely honest. Can I save her? I don't think so. I don't think it's going to happen in time. What? She actually managed. This Raylan's a goddess. I will now get over to her as fast as I possibly can, because that is stupidly good. Okay, hold on. Get out of here. Shoot. Don't worry, Raylan. I am here. I can help, maybe. I doubt it, but just maybe. We're going to leave that soul on the ground because we got other things to do right now. Namely, oh, maybe not die. Well, nope, thank you. <sighs> Didn't quite get the saw blade pull that I wanted there. Ooh, good zaps. Good zaps. No, not quite there. That's fine. Also, oh, good. Virus protection and, and stuff. That's nice. Thank you, computer. I appreciate it. But could you not do that while I'm in the middle of a match? Alright, so Ceremonial Mask is definitely the right call, almost at all times. Definitely do that. It is, it is such a good upgrade, holy cow. I hadn't realized how good it was on its own. You don't even need the extra bounces, and it still does a lot of work. Okay, toss one of these, then toss out one of these. Then, then bounce up, then take this saw blade in, and then zap him for it. And then just keep on making bacon here. This is actually okay. No! No! Oh my god, the slow on the orb was too much. Okay, so that's a sign. I think that we need to get Baby Curry Mammoth next. Ooh, good Leon kill. Uh, Baby Curry Mammoth is going to be huge for us. The ability to somewhat survive stuff like Time Rift or that slow is going to be massively important. Also, dealing with the silence that Leon's eventually going to get two out of two ranks up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely Baby Curry Mammoth. That is the correct choice. 
Um, now, another correct choice here might be, like, just more damage. So, we're going to go ahead and grab our second rank of Star Storm statue. Uh, you might be realizing that, hey, first off, you don't have regen. Well, those of you who are astute might have also noticed that we do have Lifesteal on Saws. And Lifesteal on Saws is practically as good, uh, I'm coming to realize. Used properly, that is. Uh, then, also, we don't have boots. Well, I mean, Scree moves so fast baseline, it's actually disgusting. It's actually the grossest thing I've ever seen. His Scree actually has stupid movement. It is incredibly good. It is so much better than Voltar's. It actually hurts to say that I wish that I knew how to play Scree. I, it's not true. I, I don't want to know how to play Scree on a very, like, ast like astoundingly good level because there's no way I could pull it off. Um, ooh, look at that zap. Ooh, girl, look at that zap. Ooh, I work out. Hey, what's up? Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Yep, saw that one coming. Oh no. Okay, so Raylan needs more help than, uh. Whoop. Nice shit right there. Gotcha! Okay, we're gonna go ahead and grab that HP right there. We could have given that to Dykreen instead. Now Leon is going to be a prime problem. Yep, yeah, there we go. I thought that was gonna happen. Boink! Nice kill, nice kill. Alright, now it's just me versus Blinghound, and, uh, I also have Artie Cell on my team, so that's fine. I, like, this is looking like a very positive thing for us. We can get in a couple more pokes here. Whoop. Yep, and then that's it. That's it. That's all. Uh, Bling Island is going to 100% uh, moidle us if we let him. Okay, grab. Uh, excuse me? Pardon me? I was supposed to lifesteal that. I feel bad that I did not. We are now without a Swiggins with us. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. I'm not going to worry about it too much. I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to stop this from becoming a problem. There we go. Completely annihilated. And that took absolutely no effort to do. That's... Just something that Scree's good at. Everything, really. But uh, he can clear things, he can harass things, he does a, like, a stupid amount of damage incredibly fast. So, yeah, I have got no real complaints about how this game is going currently. Oh my lord. Oh my lord! The nibs! The nibs! Okay, uh, we need more damage. We could also go for slow on the... S Ooh, isn't that a neat idea? We could go for slow on the left click, slow on the saw blade... Uh, how about we go for Lashes of the Goddess, though? I, I do mean it sincerely. Damage is king in this game, and having more damage is not going to hurt. So we lost our bottom turret. This is definitely a game that can take back. They have three extremely strong late-game characters that are capable of dealing thousands of damage in seconds. Um, and why don't we grab Slow on this saw blade? It's not the optimal build. A lot of people like going for the double, like the dual saws and a whole bunch of other garbage. I, I can't land it, is the problem. I legitimately cannot land that ability to save my life. Not the way that it needs to be landed in order to, you know, do stuff. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just take it easy for a second. Wait for it. Yep, there's the bad stuff. They have now poked. That is fine. Toss out one of those things. Okay, good saw blade. Good saw blades. Honestly, that was huge. Oh, God. It's not enough. Get out of there. Thank you, Blinghound, for not getting me killed. All right. Uh, that, that was going to be mine. I'm very, very mad at you. Whoa! Get that zapping going. Oh god, no, 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 oh my god. Uh, at least we got a kill. At least we got a kill. So it was a three for two, which is definitely not ideal. Blinghound could definitely do some work now as a result. Um, where are we going wrong right now? Like, we're doing okay. Seven, five, and six is not an awful score. We're also clearing incredibly well. Surprisingly, we're, we're like, as a scree, I'm doing fine. The issue right now is that we can't seem to break past the... You know, well, like, if they initiate even a little bit with nibs, we are toast. We can't get through the nibs. I'm not sure exactly how to deal with the nibs, personally. I don't think as a Scree I have very many tools to deal with her. But, um... Okay, so we've got a saw blade out in the middle of nowhere for reasons. It's okay. Don't even worry about it too much. That sucked. Oh, God. Well, we are now alone. Uh, if that wasn't surprising enough to you. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and just toss this out immediately. A little ahead. To be able to maybe land a couple of neat kind of... Not kills, but like... Okay, no. Get out. Shoot. Oh my lord! Ah, oh, that nibs. I can't get past it. The, the nibs, 100%, I think, wiped our team. That ability to pull is so good! Alright, well, fair enough. Uh, a little bit of displacement is all that it takes to kill me, apparently. 
Oh my god, finally, a kill on the nibs. We needed that. Uh, can we bring this back? I'm not sure. We still have to get through a turret. We still have to deal with the fact that they got super droids coming and all this other stuff. Like, we had a very commanding early game. But, like, wow. Increases the range and speed, has slow, has this, all this other stuff. Man, yeah, the the nibs is doing an incredible job. Don't get me wrong, so is Blinghound. They're, they're all doing well. But uh, it is worth mentioning right now. Right now, anyway. Um, oh, my lord. Let's bring this back. I cannot believe it. He lived. Damn it. Um... Never mind, we're going to have a bad time right now. Uh, what was I saying? It's worth mentioning that, like, there's a, there are some good things happening. But not a ton of them. And anytime that they get anything going on, we have a bad day. Uh, like that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's bad, that's bad. Um, anytime we seem to have, like, something coming along that's, you know, on the good side of life. Okay, we got a good pull there. Nibs didn't pull in the right spot. That's fine. Put out a totem. Dump some damage, toss one of these out, then run like a little baby. It's fine. Pull this back. We're not going to get much out of it. Get the slow out. You know what? I don't think we're winning this one. I think that their characters are just too strong late game. And we got a nice strong early game thanks to the, you know, a whole bunch of stuff. Nice. Good, good, good snipe. But, uh, there's, you know, the slight problem that, oh, ho, ho, you thought that you could sneak in a clone. You were, uh, almost correct, honestly. Yeah, honestly, the nibs is just insane. Toss one of these. No way! I'm actually surprised as hell. That was an incredible orb. I thought that I had stopped it with my totem. I was so wrong. So what do I do? Increase the health of totem as a knockback pulse? That doesn't do anything. Oh god, they got nibs on the core again? No, we're not going to win this. I thought we had such a good game lined up, and then we just got out late game. The characters got too strong on the other team. I, I think one of the big problems is that, you know, Raylan against Nibs, I mean, unless if the Raylan plays incredibly well, like most of the time, then we end up having a bit of a problem. You know what I mean? Like there are some, oh God, ah, my Lord. Okay, got her, and then back off like a little baby. Oh God, oh God, I'm dead. Shit, I did try, I did try. But the rest of my team would need, you know, to actually need to, figure this one out oh that was rough that was very very rough well played very well played the random button betrayed me again <laughs> so i didn't play a good enough scree uh scree was a good character in this case and honestly a better scree would have made a lot of magic happen sawblade destroys Raylan, destroys nibs a good chunk of the time and can do a lot of good work against the well played leon even but i'm just not a very good scree I managed to hold my own, more or less. I didn't go negative, but um, this Nibs in particular, I noticed, was incredibly difficult to deal with. Just orb into fire meant one of us died, either me or the Raylan. I was too slow to get out of it and then took too much damage. And the Raylan, I mean, same sort of deal. Anytime that she was about to snipe, she got ruined. Now, Raylan does have a means of dealing with Nibs, Time Rift, and if you Time Rift properly, like if you wait for the Nibs to come at you and then you Time Rift, there's a chance. Or if you put down Time Rift someplace so that way the Nibs can't get at you easily without putting themselves in a terrible position, again, it can sort of work. I think our biggest issue might have actually been our Swiggins at the end of the day, though. Between, you know, Time Rift, Fire... And the fact that if he got anywhere near them, he got counter-initiated from a silence double-damaging tongue. Like, Swiggins' power was strong early game and then really petered off later on down the line. That and then, you know, that, that sucked. <laughs> I think that really did cost us the match now that I look at this. So, did we do okay? Sure. Could we have done better? Absolutely. Did the other team play better than us? That's the big thing. And I'm okay with that, honestly. That was a good game. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Hope you folks enjoyed yourselves. If you did, be sure to let me know. Hit the like button down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Where hopefully I'm a little bit more, you know, conscious of what I'm able to say and all that stuff. Because this entire episode is my brain in full-on panic mode. <laughs>